Hey angels, welcome back to Unique Mystery. So the time when I harassed my high school teacher. Now let me tell you what type of teacher he was first. He was grumpy, he was mean, he was annoying, he was all of that stuff. So I was looking for something to do to make me laugh in that class to make me laugh at him you know so me and a friend we came up with this idea before we get into class what we would do is we would draw this picture because like he was a a big man okay so we would draw this picture like of this big cartoon character and it looked very funny and I don't remember what all I wrote on it but I would write funny things on it you know just to describe the picture and just funny crazy stuff oh yeah and we also wrote his name on it saying hi I'm blah 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 with his name so yeah so what we planned to do was every day Every day before the period, we would beat everybody else to the class. When we got to the class, the doors was locked because he didn't unlock the doors until he, he got there. So we would push this letter underneath the door. <laughs> so that's what we did every day. So the first day we decided to do it, okay? We draw this big, funny cartoon character that kind of looked like him and we wrote inside of it hi I'm with his name there right and a bunch of other funny stuff on it and we got there that first day and we took the letter and we pushed it under the door make sure nobody was looking in the halls nobody was watching us and we went for it and pushed it under the door so the first day I can remember when um, he came to the class, okay, the bell rang. Everybody came to the class. Oh, yeah. So once we did that, once we would push it under, under the door, we would leave. So it could make it look like, you know, that we wasn't there first or anything, you know. So nobody could get any ideas. So we'd leave, okay. And when the bell rang, we'd come back with everybody else. <laughs> So the first day once the bell rung, we came back and everybody came to class. He opened the door, we all went inside, cut the, he cut the lights on and everybody got seated. So he noticed that there was a paper on the floor. So he picked up the paper <laughs> and he just started looking at it and he was like reading it and everything and he saw the picture and he was like, what's this? <laughs> And he threw it in the trash. Okay. So, me and my friend was just like holding our laugh in. We had to hold it in so hard because it was so funny. But we did it. We held it in. So, class just went on. So, the second day, we did the same thing. We beat everybody to class. We draw our picture. Put his name on it. And put a lot of other funny stuff in the picture. On the paper. And we pushed it under the door. So then the second day. Okay and then we left. And came back when the bell rang. With everybody else. Same thing. He came. He opened the door. Everybody went in. Got seated. He cut on the lights. And he started teaching this day. The second day. So he just started teaching and like after a few minutes he noticed the paper again that was on the floor. So he looked down at the floor and me and my friend we was just like oh god. We just had to hold our laugh in so hard. It was so hard for me because it's just hard for me to hold in a laugh. So I had to do it with all of my might. Hold my laugh in and not laugh. So. He noticed the paper on the floor. He went and picked it up in the middle of teaching. He read it and looked at the picture once again. And he said, anybody knows who's doing this? And everybody was like, what? No, you know, no, we have no idea, whatever. Even me and my friend was like, no, 
<laughs> and he was like, I, I sure wish I know who could do this, who's doing this. <laughs> and he threw it in the trash. It was so, so funny. But anyways, I would say this went on, had to be, I would think, for like two weeks straight until we decided to stop. But we was doing this like every day for those two weeks, you know, the same procedure. We beat everybody to class, um, look around, make sure nobody's looking, nobody's watching or seeing us. We'd... Um, before we got there, we had our picture drawn and everything we wanted to say, and we slipped it under the door. And every time we got to the class, it never failed. After a few minutes of him teaching, he'll notice it, and he'll pick it up. He'll pick it up, and he'll read it all over again. I think he stopped maybe after... I think he stopped reading it maybe like after a week. He got tired. <laughs> Because he caught on and knew what was going to be on the paper. So I think he just caught on and stopped reading it. And he'd just pick it up and throw it in the trash. Like, you know, he was mad. <laughs> but I can tell you, it was just hilarious. It was so funny. <sighs> we got so much laughs off of that. I mean, it was just funny. Just imagine. And we had to hold our laughs in the whole time, every time it happened, because we didn't want to be noticed. We didn't want nobody to think it was us. But yeah, that was the time when I harassed my high school teacher. And I'm not saying any names in case he's watching this video or he come across this video or whatever. But yeah, this was very fun for us, me and my friend. And you know, we just needed something to do back then because he was just annoying, he was grumpy, he was mean, and we wanted to do something to make us laugh in that class. So that's what we put together, and it was a success because it definitely worked. It got us laughing. I mean, we had fun after that. Everything was just so funny. You would just have to see his face and everything. <laughs> It was just so funny. So yeah, thanks so much guys um, for coming. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Like, let me know what you think of this story. And did you ever do anything like this in high school, in school? Um, would you ever thought of doing anything like this? But yeah, just let me know. So thanks so much for watching, and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.